I'm going to demonstrate um, the C code fuzzer uh, or the C code mirror, which is a Bluetooth car device uh, which attaches over your rear view mirror on the car and serves as both a rear view mirror and a Bluetooth car phone kit. So for your mobile phone, you'll be able to make and receive calls through this mirror. Um, it comes in a nice tidy box, as you can see. And in the box, you have the, the C code fuzzer, you have a, a manual for instructions, and you have your in-car charger. Now, before you do anything with your fuzzer, you're supposed to charge it for eight continuous hours. Now, this may or may not be practical in your car, and if it's not, you can purchase a mains adapter which allows you to charge it from home. And now once, once the device is char charged up, it's ready to be paired to your mobile phone. And I'm gonna demonstrate now how to uh, pair it up to your mobile. So we'll start off, this one has been charged. We'll, start, we'll just turn it on. You'll see the C code on the, on the screen. Um, now when you're pairing, you're starting to pair it with your mobile, you just hit the menu or the M button for a few seconds. The screen eventually will show ready pairing. See there, re ready pairing on the screen, so it means it's ready to be paired with your, with your mobile phone. Um, now you have to check your own mobile phone's instructions with regards to finding the, the Bluetooth um, and pairing it with a Bluetooth device, but they're generally fairly straightforward. This one is a Nokia, so we just go to the Bluetooth section um, and we'll click on the new paired device. So we're looking for a new paired device, click yes. Um, and you'll see the C code there as an option. Now it's waiting for the C code, so it's waiting to get a signal from the device and it's got one already. Um, it's asked for a password. So in, in this case with the C code, it's, it's four zeros. So it's zero, 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 okay. And already it's paired with the C code. Uh, and on the C code device, when it's paired, you'll see an, an okay has come up on the screen. And it's asked me now to, to authorize device to make connections automatically. So that means when you're, you're get into your car with your phone, and your Bluetooth is on, that it would automatically pair it. And I'll say yes to that. It's asked me, do I want to connect to the C code? And I said yes. So at the moment, it's connecting to the C code. And you can see there on the C code, e -Kiron, which is the mobile phone user, has come up. So already these two devices have been paired in the, in the, in the space of a few seconds, they're already paired. And the next um, bit that I'm going to show you is how to transfer your phone book of contacts from your mobile phone onto the C code device.